So let's just say this was the worst camping trip ever. It was the August going into my seventh grade, and uh, my dad and sister came into my room. They said, hey, we're going camping. It was on the spot decision. They just said, we're going. So I packed my bags, threw them in the back of my mom's Toyota Sequoia. <laughs> Why is, Why is that funny? Okay, just... <laughs> okay, so... We trekked up to Maine. I don't need, know exactly where. It was just a campground uh, in the backwoods. Uh, we got there at like 3 o'clock. Um, right when we got there, I set up tents, put the sleeping bags out, got the cooler, had all the gadgets we needed. We were uh, all set, other than the fire. Uh, my dad decided that it was my job to get all the firewood. So I went out at like 5 o'clock after we'd been there for a little while to get uh, firewood. And there was a pond there, and I walked around it to try and find like where there was dead wood on the ground. And I got to the other side, and I picked up the, the wood, but it was getting darker, and I couldn't really see. So <laughs> I tried to find the path that I came on, and I couldn't find it. And uh, so I started to panic a little bit. and. I yelled for my dad, and I didn't hear anything. <laughs> so I uh, did what I thought was best, and I went back to like where the pond was, and I tried to walk around it because I thought we could go all the way around. But I walked so far, and there was just no sight of the campground that I was at. So I turned around and went back the other way, but I kept getting lost, and um, it was it was scary. But what I did was I tried to keep my composure, and I kept walking and I found the path that I was originally on <laughs> and I found my way back to uh, the campground we were at and when I got there my dad and sister acted like I hadn't even been gone. Uh, my dad asked where I was but he didn't sound all that concerned and I was kind of freaking out because I had just been in the woods by myself for like an hour and a half and I guess he didn't think it was a big deal. but. Um, it was one of the scariest moments of my life, and I did what I could to keep my composure and learned how to do that in difficult situations. And just recently, a few years ago, uh, I was in a similar situation on my boat where we were in the middle of the lake and uh, the battery ran out of juice. And I began to panic, but <laughs> kept my composure, started rowing back to shore, and luckily some guy came and towed us back, but that was just one of those times when I used what I learned back on my camping trip to keep myself calm and get myself out of a difficult situation. Uh -huh.